Sometimes uh, citations won't be pre-formatted like in our databases. For example, when you're using the Perseus collection. So I'm going to walk you through how to create your own citation using zbib.org. So if you find something you want to use about your subject on, say, Perseus, a lot of the information, an incomplete citation, will be at the bottom. So you go to zbib.org, click on Manual Entry, choose Web Page in this case, and you're going to go back to the source and look for the title of the document. Seven against thieves. It'll force you to kind of think about what you're looking at. Next, we need the author. I think that's Ice uh, Askylus, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. In this case, we have a translator as well, so we want to add translator as an option. If you go back to the page, you'll see there is the translator's name, Herbert Weir Smith, PhD. And now you want to know what website is this is. In the About section, you'll see it's a Perseus Digital Library. Next, we'll look at Publisher. And this will go back to the actual source information that we were looking at. And the source, the publisher is Harvard University Press. And it was published in 1926. You'll want to copy the URL, of course, and the date you accessed it, and enter that. And once you get this information entered into the template, you'll click Cite, and then at the bottom you can see we have a complete citation. I highlight the citation, copy it, and then I paste it into my Works Cited page. And of course, it will be in alphabetical order, so I put that at the top based on the first word of my citation. And there you go. If you need help, don't forget to reach out to Ms. Wenger or myself at SI librarians, excuse me, SI underscore librarians at siprep.org.